After opening the picture in Photoshop Elements, we first select the Quick Edit Tool mode, and then we choose the Quick Selection Tool. Make sure it's selected. And of the two choices, we want the Quick Selection Tool, the left choice. We want it to be in Add mode. And for this image, a good brush size is 13 pixels. There's nothing magic about this. We could set it larger or smaller. In fact, let's set it to 24 pixels. And we're now going to click and drag down the areas we want to select, the background. So I'm clicking down and dragging down. And I've selected the left side. Now I'm going to click and drag down and select the right side. And after that's been done, we want to refine the edge so we don't have a sharp edge. So we click Refine Edge. We can now see what the edge is looking like. We're going to change the feathering to 2 pixels, which is a good softening of the edge so it's not quite so obvious. There's the 2 pixels right there. Click OK, and that's now got the edge refined. Now to change the background colors, we can choose the Color tool and it would normally come up with saturation as our first choice. And one way to get rid of that background color is to simply select the least saturation. We have a variety of choices of how much saturation we want, but the least um, saturation would change it to gray. Another choice would be to use the Hue tool to change the hue of the background, and some of the preset choices we see allow us to change it to various colors, and if we wanted like a blue, we could use this tool right here. But for this demonstration, we're going to choose saturation and desaturate it completely so that we now have a gray background. And once we're through with this, we can remove the selection that we've made by deselecting the image. And now we have the resulting image.